friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Johanna. For those of you who are new here, welcome. For those of you who are returning, welcome back. A great big shout out to my channel members for supporting my channel. Thank you. All right, so it is currently Monday, uh, 9.45 p.m. I want to do a quick video uh, to set up my next week in my Hobonichi Weeks for Hobonichi Weeks Wednesday. I do want to show you uh, some stickers. <laughs> hey, Doodle, how you doing? <laughs> that I picked up recently. And then we'll just uh, finish up the setup because I've already started. So actually, let's just start with the stickers. Now, I've had this particular set, and they are linked in the description box below, where I bought uh, January through June and July through December and the way it is is you get like one of these large stickers and then you get several of these smaller stickers now I prefer this because if I'm setting up either a journal spread or my Hobonichi weeks I like that it takes up a lot of space especially in those weeks that have not much going on and so I found this set here and what it is, it's four sticker sheets in each of these packs and they have a theme. So perfectionist, individualist, leader, achiever, thinker, helper, loyalist, peacemaker, and this is adventurer. And all four of the sticker sheets have a large character on it with some smaller um, little things next to it. And I do prefer this. Actually, I do prefer it over the one that I showed you earlier because this takes up the entire side of my Hobonichi Weeks. This I can actually uh, fit some other things in and when I do uh, my setup, I'll actually show you that. So if you're interested, I'll go ahead and link this set below in the description box. And the way that this is listed, I believe it's January through June, anime stickers, um, July through December, and then I will uh, somehow denote what these are because again this all came in as a set I've already started setting up so let me show you that this is my Motrum cover I will continue to use it until basically it falls apart and these are some uh, tabs that my friend Andy had given to me I will need this little stencil and this was just a card that came with one of my Hobonichi things so I just <laughs> stuck it in here I don't really get too fussed about this I know some people go all out but it, it just I need it to hold my actual Hobonichi this is my Hobonichi weeks in one piece English edition and this is the fourth sticker, and I've already decided on this and set up the rest of the week. Uh, it is currently Monday, like I said, so I will put some stickers up here because I don't need this space. This will be completed tasks, breakfast and lunch that's served in the cafeteria, and then the lunch I'm actually eating for that particular day. I will be pulling a tarot card for the week in this spot here, a uh, tarot card for the daily, and then here is thoughts for the week and this is doodle of the week and I'll actually have some room down here to do the word maybe I should do that up here since we have the open spot yeah let's do that Okay, so while that's drying, I'm going to put her down. And because I can see underneath it, I know that she fits. So she's going to take up this right here. And because she's a washi type of sticker, it she seems to just disappear right into the page. You don't really see the edge. We don't need this little box right here. So we can put a sticker there. This is going to be the word. And this is an open spot right here. 
Let's put our mood tracker here. Don't know that I've done this one for a few weeks. The Tombow I'm using is 243. Okay, and that's a good week. And that's not so great week. Put some stickers down. Okay, maybe a, like one over here. I kind of like this cat and the bunny. That's really cute too. And it looks like, unlike some of my other sticker sheets, everything on this one is kiss cut. Oh, is that a dog? Because why is it thinking of a bone? Hmm. Well, whatever it is, I like it. Oh, that's crooked. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm missing the quote of the week. Well, good. We've got a spot open. <laughs> okay, and that basically is the deco. I'll need to remember to put the quote there. I'm going to take this and probably one or two of those sticker sheets to work because I do need to set up some other sections for June. Now, last week, this is one of my blotter sheets. Let me just put this down. I did not finish some of my research because I was not feeling well. I caught a cold. I actually still have it. It's definitely on the tail end of it. Um, but I caught, uh, I actually started feeling bad here. I was out here and here. And so the research here, I didn't do. The quote in the doodle, I actually will do all of this probably uh, first thing tomorrow after I pull my tarot card, as well as I'll do some thoughts on, on being sick for the week. And then for the notes and the OT, I'm just going to leave that blank. This I would normally leave but I actually enjoy doing the research on the characters doing a doodle from one piece and doing a quote from one piece as you can see um, I'm not doing one piece anymore as we're going into June whether I'm going to use this sticker or other stickers I have in my arsenal that just remains to be seen I do like that I think that's really pretty uh, but all of May I did one piece and I really really enjoyed it all right, well, again, quick and simple. I'll go ahead and insert uh, what I ate for those few days I was in the office for last week. And as always, aloha. Hey guys, lunch for today, Monday, May 22nd, is a Marie Callender's chicken pot pie from Costco. A toss green salad with Pietro's original Asian dressing and some wonton strips. A breakfast I had Oh, ramen. <laughs> I didn't bring anything and I had ramen in the office, so I had that. Uh, water throughout and a coffee midday. That's it for today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, lunch for today is Taniokas. It is Wednesday, May 24th. So that's a lot. So what I plan on eating for lunch today is um, half of one of these vegetable tempuras fried chicken and the fried rice and some of this namasu it's a pickled cucumber and radish dish uh, in this container which is empty i plan on putting um, the rest of the tempura as well as the corned beef hash maybe even a piece of chicken to eat for lunch tomorrow whether i have that with my rice or if i make noodles with it i'm not sure that's a problem for tomorrow and whatever is left of this uh, breakfast i had a pastrami sandwich just because there was some leftover pastrami in the fridge with water actually water throughout and coffee midday that's it for today i'll see you guys tomorrow hey guys lunch for today thursday may 25th is some leftovers from yesterday so i showed you the uh, seafood vegetable tempura and the corned beef hash white rice. I'm going to put some of this photocopy on the rice. I've got some of the namasu and I've got wasabi and shoyu. I'll mix it up and I'll use that for the tempura. I still have a bit of a cold so I'm not sure if we'll be in tomorrow but breakfast today I had a hot dog 
bun from a local Chinese bakery with water and coffee midday. This afternoon I'm actually having a donut because I bought from the same place I bought the Chinese bun. I actually bought donuts for the office. Anyway, that's it for lunch today. If for any reason I don't show tomorrow, hope you guys had or have a great weekend. Bye.